SM Videos, the leader in football education. Hi, I'm Rex Lardner, the managing editor of American Football Monthly, and our guest today is Taylor Burks, a high school coach in Tennessee who specializes in a 3-5-3 defense. He just completed a three-set series now available on afmvideos.com on the 3-5-3 defense. He's going to take a minute now and talk to us a little bit about linebacker drills and specifically how linebackers can stay inside out. Coach? One of my favorite drills that I like to run each day is a simple, easy inside-out drill. And I have a linebacker uh, line up, half a man behind the ball carrier. Mm -hmm. ball carrier will be facing this way. He'll be a half a man behind, and, we'll, and I'll say walk, and, we'll, and he'll take off walking. And the half linebacker will shuffle, 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 and stay half a man behind him. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then I'll say jog, and he'll take off jogging. And he's got speed to shuffle up to stay half man, always staying a half man behind. It gives them that relationship. Mm -hmm. And then sprint, and then we're, we're kind of got this sideways run going with our shoulders uh, square to the line of scrimmage, keeping our shoulders square and our pad level low. But we want to make sure that we stay half man behind. We'll slow down to a walk afterwards and make sure make him slow down to a walk to make sure they get the understanding of staying inside out on the football. Gotcha. What is it, what, why is it so crucial to be half a man behind? Uh, you're cutting down the angles mm -hmm. of a cutback. If, if you over pursue, if the ball carrier's here and you, and you get up here in front, then you've given him a cutback lane here. I if I'm here at this angle here as the linebacker, then he cuts back. Then I'm right here to make the play. If I keep, if he keeps running, then I keep running, and I'm able to be a half a man behind and then get there and make the play. Gotcha. Okay. That's Coach Taylor Burks, and it's um, one of three DVDs that he just completed on the 353, now available at afmvideos.com.